Oh, super. Change of angle. The forehand starting to motor now. That's bad news for Istanbul. <laughs> vintage Nadal. You just know it's goodbye almost, don't you? Yeah. He's got so many varied shots. Is it going to be hook cross court? Is it going to be lobbed? Glorious. Just good enough, the angled volley from Nadal. Oh. Like a bullet. Mention he's a big man, and that really did stay here. 30 low. Just ghosting in. Oh, you got that back. So very fine. Oh, it's a great fetch, that one from Rafa. Just too quick and too cute. Yeah. He did set up rather invitingly. So good. Wasn't sure if he was going to hit it on the forehand and almost overran it. He misanticipated this, but it didn't work out too badly. He did well in the end to get the sort of underspin, the slice on the backhand because it barely rose. It seemed to hit almost a soft patch of grass. Game for set Nadal. It was tough. It was very tough for Nadal. Low, the ball keeps in the grass. Well, they keep talking about because he would have been passed. Game Nadal. But some of Nadal serves, and this Nadal picks up from the first. Much more like it. Yes. Whoa! 
Well, there have been few explosions for Rafa in the second set, but that was as good as anything. Cracker from Nadal, and there's a, another explosion. It's on the line. <laughs> a dazzling trick shot from Rafa. And he reacts as if it was nothing special. 30 all. Well, I thought it was cheeky from Isterman, but the way it bounced, I thought there was no way that Nadal could win this. That is sheer genius. This is going to be a very exciting third set. And of course the uh, question is, continue, yes, look to win Queens, yes, but is it uh, going to aggravate things with Wimbledon ahead? He had to miss it last year. Well, it's a wonderful stroke on any surface, isn't it? Just super. And his volleying has been uh, consistently good. They're such a close knit family. Well played. His knees, career threatening, are they? I don't want to be looking to stretch away. Made it. <laughs> A Nadal special. That really did draw a look from Istami. A pure shock. Yes. <sighs> Had him. Ouch. I mean, this would be a huge hole. Super. Magnificent. Truly magnificent. Made it. It's one way to deal with the wind. Yeah, it's just blast right through it. And of course, it's uh, reached that sort of time of night. This is like a, a bit of electricity. Didn't fancy that at all, did he? What defence from Istamin. <laughs> Made it. <laughs> Would you believe it? Istamin saves two match points and he stays in this match.
It's long. Nadal has a third match point. <laughs> Old faithful to the rescue. As one. Just under 7,000 people rise to salute a stunning finish to a gruelling encounter. Istamin was a hero, but it still wasn't enough. Nadal, that winning smile once more. On behalf of everybody who watched that match, thank you for the most fantastic entertainment, but it was probably a bit closer than you wanted. Well, you know how difficult this play on grass after coming to play, and uh, Istamin is a, is a good player. Uh, I think his, his game adapts very well to, to this surface because he plays flat and he has a good serves, he can go to the volley. So, yeah, it wasn't easy for me. The day was difficult too, a lot of wind. Um, the weather, like, when, when you have the weather clouded like this, the, the, the court, the bounce stays lower and for me it's a little bit better if the sunshine in the, the court is dry. This is our summer. Yeah, well, no, no. I played uh, a lot of matches here with with the good Sancho. Listen, we, we saw you have an injury timeout. What was that that about, and uh, how I are felt, you? I felt something here in the, behind the leg, so just I wanted to check with the, with the physio if it's something uh, dangerous or not. So I'm gonna check another time now, but uh, I can finish the match playing playing well. How do you feel at the moment? I am feeling great, very good. Yeah. Well, you played great. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks a lot.